Well, we start tonight with yet another update in the case of a Heartland man who killed a Rhode Island woman in a wrong way drunk driving crash on I-89 about two weeks ago. Now, the state's liquor board is investigating Peking, Tokyo in Lebanon, where 38-year-old Daniel Cowdery of Heartland consumed alcohol before driving home to Vermont. The Valley News reports that the New Hampshire Liquor Commission, in cases like this, follows the trail back to where the suspect was provided alcohol to see if the restaurant or source is at fault for allowing one too many drinks and violating protocol. An affidavit states that Cowdery told police he had a few beers at Peking, Tokyo before driving home. Police say that on May 25th, Cowdery was driving home the wrong way, drunk, on I-89 and hit 34-year-old Ellen Kolsch of Rhode Island, killing her and sending her 4-year-old son to Dartmouth-Hitchcock for treatment of serious injuries. Since the accident, a memorial fund has been set up online to help raise money for the husband and son of Kolsch, which has raised over $46,000 so far.